Jose Maria Canlas Sissonwis, born on February 8, 1939, died December 16, 2022, also known by his nickname Oma, was a Filipino writer and activist who founded the Communist Party of the Philippines and added elements of Mi Oisdo, its philosophy, which would be known as national democracy. Before we continue, if you are new to my channel, please consider to subscribe. Click like and notification bell for you to get updated to our new Pinnet Payment TV video upload. Jose Maria Canlas Sissonwis, born February 81,939, died December 16, 2022, also known by his nickname Joma, was a Filipino writer and activist who founded the Communist Party of the Philippines and added elements of Mioisdo, its philosophy, which would be known as national democracy. From August 2002, he was classified as a person supporting terrorism by the United States. The European Union's second highest court ruled in September 2009 to delist him as a person supporting terrorism and reversed a decision by member governments to freeze his assets. Sisson would later live in the Netherlands, applying for asylum as a political refugee in 1988, a contested request which was eventually approved in 1995. The CPP, along with its affiliates New People's Army and the National Democratic Front, are also considered terrorist organizations by the Philippines Anti-Terrorism Council. This political biography or autobiography offers a unique look into the political beliefs and motivations of Professor Sisson, renowned revolutionary leader, writer, poet and founder of the Communist Party of the Philippines CCP. This collaboration between Sisson and American Book Award-winning novelist, Ninochka Roska, goes far to illuminate the political climate and history of the United States' role in Filipino politics. In the frank exchange between Sisson and Rosca regarding the Filipino revolutionary movement, the issues of women's rights and empowerment within the CCP, as well as ethnicity, class, age and education, are also addressed. Jose Maria Sisson at Home in the World Portrait of a Revolutionary is a book that can offer the other side of the story chronicling the life of a Filipino revolutionary, his political party and his country, untouched and unfiltered by outside political propaganda. Jose Maria Sisson is a popular Philippines politician who is most renowned for his politician, writer. Jose Maria Sisson was studied in Ateneo de Manila University, University of the Philippines, Colegio de San Juan de Letran, Political Party, New People's Army, Communist Party of the Philippines. Check how rich is Jose Maria Sisson in 2020. Also latest information on Jose Maria Sisson cars, Jose Maria Sisson income, remuneration, lifestyle, based on online sources. Jose Maria Sisson estimated net worth is $5 million Dillard and primary income from politician, writer. We don't have enough evidences on Jose Maria Sisson cars, Jose Maria Sisson lifestyle, we will update these information soon. Well, si Joma Sison, uh, may, he re may, may he rest in peace. May the Lord forgive him for all the people that died because of him. Oh, you know, there is an yeah. end to everyone. Pinoa Payman, what do you think about his death? Former Senator Juan Ponce in real has a message for him. There is the end for everyone. May the good Lord forgive him because of what he has done. If you are new to my YouTube channel, please don't forget to click subscribe button, click like and notification bell for you to get updated to our Pinoa Payment TV new upload. Thank you for watching. God bless.